Welcome back everybody. It is Saturday, May 27th, run streak day 236. We're heading up to Union Park because it's the opening day of the uh, Heritage Carousel, which I've never really gotten that close of a look at. Um, at last time they had it open, it was a private event, so I couldn't like get in and check it out. But I'm hoping to get some uh, footage and pictures of it today. All right, so we've arrived at uh, Union Park here. We're making our way around the back side of the park towards the carousel. But how's the run street going? Pretty good. Um, still doing my normal five to six miles a day, obviously. This last week, um, I've been keeping the runs a little slower and a little shorter, just because I had some uh, pain in my hip for whatever reason. Lasted about four or five days there. Feels a lot better today. So that's good news. I got some good rest yesterday. I think that definitely helped. Uh, not really feeling much uh, pain today at all. So hopefully by tomorrow, it'll be 100% again. Right now, feels like it's about 85%. All right, we've made it. This is the Heritage Carousel here. Looks like they're open uh, Tuesday through Sunday, 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. So actually it's more hours than I thought they were open. I don't have to come here on like a weekend or something. Um, but we're gonna walk around the carousel, check it out, see if I can get some footage. There's a lot of kids and stuff in there, so I don't really want to film a bunch of kids, but uh, we'll see what we can get. Almost tempted to ride this thing myself here. I don't know how much it costs. I only have a credit card on me, so I don't know if they actually take cards or if it's cash only, I'm not sure. But I don't think I'm gonna ride it without Inga. I'll probably bring her up here maybe at some point this week and we'll hop on and take a little spin on this guy. Pretty cool looking, pretty fun. Kids are all on there having a good time anyway. So I'm gonna finish my run. I'm like halfway done with my run right now, about two and a half miles in. I'm just doing like a five miler today. Um, but at the end of this video, I am going to have a grocery haul. Also, I'm going to show off the new pair of shoes that I bought. Uh, it's a new pair of New Balances. I figured I'd give them another shot because the ones I'm wearing now, I've actually uh, gotten, I think I'm at like 360 miles in these right now. So well over the 300 mile mark. So I'm, I'm pretty impressed with these guys and I wanted to try one of their higher tier ones instead of one of their cheaper ones. So I'll show you guys those shoes too. For now, I'm going to finish my run. Made it back to the apartment. Run today ended up being 5.22 miles. Pace today, eight minutes, 31 seconds. So not too fast, not too slow. Again, hips feeling much better, so I can probably go faster if I wanted to, or I might wait a couple more days just to be careful and try not to re-aggravate it, basically. Uh, I got a couple hours before I got to go to work. I do have to work this afternoon and into the uh, evening. But before I do, we're gonna eat. I think we're actually gonna barbecue up some uh, plant-based burgers and hot dogs. And uh, yeah, I'll shoot the video with the uh, shoes and the grocery haul as well. So stay tuned for that. Okay, a little bit of a grocery haul for the week here. We didn't need too much, so we really only went to one store. Well, technically two. So the one thing that we didn't get at Aldi was this caramel syrup stuff for uh, making coffee and whatnot. That was at World Market for, I think we paid 10 bucks for that. Everything else though is from Aldi. So you're looking at, uh, what was it? $73 and some change. So we got two things of almond milk. We got chocolate and just regular. We got some strawberries there, some bananas, of course. Four Envy apples, very large Envy apples. Thing of spinach, a couple avocados, a couple cans of pineapple. We got this three pack of bell peppers, a few tomatoes some garlic there, uh, two heads of lettuce, 
some celery, some carrots, a couple zucchinis there, some mushrooms, just regular white mushrooms, a few things of sauce. So we got two things of the reduced sodium soy sauce, and then also a stir fry sauce as well that we're gonna try. Thing of tortillas, thing of hot dog buns. Inga got her fig bars that she likes. Got a thing of frozen fruit there for smoothies. Frosted flakes, Inga likes these frosted flakes. They're one of the few cereals that we can find that doesn't have vitamin D in it, D3 specifically. Some waffle cones. And I found these uh, black bean chipotle burgers, which are actually really good and they were on sale for $2.99. So I'm pretty happy about that. Then I got myself some uh, olives, just regular Spanish olives there, garlic stuffed olives. And we also got this uh, German style pickles here, which looked really good. They were $3.50 for those. Never had them before, but they looked really, really good. So that is the grocery haul for the week. Nothing too exciting. Mostly what we needed was like produce and stuff like that. And we grabbed a couple other things, but not too much uh, special stuff. However, I did also go over to Kohl's and I found these New Balance Fresh Foam. I think they're called like Rove or something like that. It's R-O-A-V, I believe. So pretty excited about these. They were uh, 85 bucks. Actually, I think they were on sale for 75, not 85, but still. I'm um, looking forward to trying these guys out. Maybe tomorrow I will uh, actually try these out.